Oh yes! What is going on, guys? Once again, we're back here at Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, and uh, boys, I enjoyed the last one. It was real nice to jump into the nostalgia of Goku versus Vegeta, but now we get to do possibly the conclusion to the Saiyan Saga. That's probably what we're about to be doing today, but without further ado, I'm gonna let you guys know. If you have been enjoying this series, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to the channel, sign on your notifications. We're on the road to a thousand subscribers, and I would love it if you guys would join me on this journey. But without further ado, let's jump into it and see what they got in store for us in Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. All right, we're finally loading back in. All right, we got to make it back there. So let's get a move on it. We don't need to deal with any of the low level enemies. I don't need to do that. Ooh, we that is a huge red aura. Weird huge energy is getting even bigger. Uh, I don't think it's my dad's power that's gone up, is it? It feels different. Yeah, that's a Saiyan ape you see right there. Oh my god, bro. He's just huge. Krillin, what's that? Get out, Gohan. Don't let him see us. Hey. Yeah, Yajirobe? Did you forget what that furry freak is? He's a Saiyan. A Saiyan. We know. But if we can cut his tail off, he'll revert back to normal. Gohan, Yajirobe. You guys get in front and distract him. I'll wait for an opening, and then I'll slice his tail off. Uh, okay. What? Distract him? Are you out of your mind? Look, man, even if you cut him down to size, he's still gonna knock you guys silly. That's real. Of course, it's Yajirobe to keep it real like that, but yeah, that's a guarantee. <laughs> But you couldn't sense Yajirobe. Like, like, hold on, that, that speaks volumes, bro. You were so weak, he had nothing to sense of you. Insignificant trash! You're all dead! Do you hear me? I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm not dead, bro. I don't know how to tell you this, but like, I ain't even dead. Back up. Back. Wait, what you thought, boy? Hold up. Let's back up. Let's back up. Let's back up. Back up. Back up. Yeah, yeah. I'm here though. Bow, 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 bow. Oh wait, his skills the Masenko, the Y one. All right. Oh, he wildin'. Oh, he wildin'. Stop. I said stop. Stop right now. Oh, I thought he was done. Masenko. Oh, that was easy, bro. That was easy. We make it look easy. Damn you, you little runt. You're going to wish you'd never been born. Bro, who are you talking to like that? I'm gonna defeat you. Oh, not a boxing. I wonder if I get like a little Krillin, mini game or something with like here. Krillin throwing the spirit bomb. I need your help. Goku. And let's talk about right? this, bro. Let's talk about it real good. Krillin had no, two I'm opportunities scared. to save the world and he fumbled gonna, both of them. Gonna we gonna get you. to the one with like Cell and 18, but this one, he threw the spirit bomb uh, all the and missed. Energy. Bro threw it and missed. <laughs> From the earth. What? Uh, Krillin, grab my hand. Uh, like this? Oh, that is crazy. They animated that too. Yeah, you got it. And now, turn your palm up and concentrate the energy. 
into a ball. Just trust me. Whoa! There it is. So this is the... That's a spirit bomb. You, you did it. <laughs> Imagine the Girl, same thing said for Goku when it comes it to the that. spirit bomb, bro. You have to. The spirit bomb has been used, okay. a, I think, a total of three times me. in Dragon Ball Z. And two of the three times, it just didn't work. Come on. I, I can't hit him if he keeps moving all over the place like that. You don't use your eyes when throwing the spirit bomb. Seek out his evil energy with your mind and release the attack! Who's there? Bro's concerned about the voice when he's got the fate of the world uh, literally in his hand. The one who taught Goku the spirit bomb technique. Remember, that ball contains the hope of every person on the planet. I mean, if only he wasn't feeling like under pressure before. Okay. Out his evil energy. I can feel it. I can. I can feel his evil energy. There it is. Uh oh. Here goes nothing. <laughs> and go on with the The ball won't hurt you if there's no evil in your heart. The bo bo boing. Imagine the spirit bomb blew up and everything, but Vegeta just kind of like jumped off before it got any far place. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we did it! <laughs> Boom! Boy, Vegeta went through a time on Earth. Bro, you don't know. Oh my good I forgot. No. No. Wait, do I get to be the great ape? Please tell me I get to be the great ape. Why did you see how ripped he was? Not immediately cutting off his tail. Come on. Come on. We didn't get to see Gohan wreak havoc. Oh, but Vegeta, no. I can't move. Oh. Wow, bro. I thought it was going to be more to this entire part right here, but it seems like that that's going to be all for this part of the story. I got to see what the cutscene does, because it's going to be crazy if this was the ending of the Saiyan saga. How can I, the great Vegeta, be reduced to this? Where 
do you think you're going? <laughs> Regain his strength and come back and kill everyone. I, I know. N Nyla, what? This guy killed our friends. He came here to massacre everyone on the planet. He's not just gonna pull a piccolo and just change sides. <laughs> and foreshadowing. I know, Krillin. But, but please, I know what I'm asking is selfish, crazy even. Do me this favor. Let him live so I can fight him again someday. <laughs> okay, fine. I guess if anybody's got the right to ask for that, it's you. I mean, if it weren't for you, this whole planet would be toast. But if we're gonna do this, then you gotta blow this guy away with everything you got when he comes back. You got it. <clears throat> You're going to regret this. You... You won't have another miracle to save you next time. <laughs> Enjoy this time, because it's all you have left. And then the next time you actually see each other, you're semi on the same side. There they are. Hey, over here. Whoa. Boma, Yamcha, the others, they're all gone. We're, we're the only ones left. Piccolo's gone too. Uh, that means Kami and the Dragon Balls, they're all gone. So, so you mean Yamcha can't ever be? <laughs> Bulma, don't cry. Actually, there might be a way for us to bring everyone who was killed back after all. What? Those Saiyans saw Piccolo and said something about him being a Namekian. They said the Namekian home planet, planet Namek, should even have more powerful Dragon Balls than then that means, if we head over to that Namek place or whatever, we... We might be able to get our hands on some Dragon Balls! And then our journey starts into the next portion of this game. Hey, it's me, Goku! You know, in the fight with Vegeta, we lost a lot of our friends. And with Piccolo gone, we can't use the Dragon Balls to bring anybody back. Wait a second. There are Dragon Balls on Planet Namek? Kami's homeworld? How are the guys gonna get there? Stay tuned for the next episode of Dragon Ball Z! The legendary Super Saiyan versus the evil Emperor Frieza! Don't miss it! Oh man, oh man, they gave me that small little, the small little shot of Goku turning Super Saiyan, and I love it. I love what I just seen, bro. We don't know nothing that's in store, but I can't wait to see it, and I hope y'all can't wait to see it either. All right, y'all, you can see it. We back in the crib with Chi Chi. That's the end of the Saiyan Saga. The next time I jump on this game, it will be to tackle Planet Namek. It'll be our start on the Namek Saga, and we're going to find out what's hitting over there. But until next time, leave your comments down below what you guys are looking forward to in this game. And I'll see everybody next time. But until then, take care and peace. Bow to the king. That's right, bow to the king. Bow to the king. That's right, bow to the king. Bow to the king. That's right, bow to the king. Bow to the king.
to the king. That's right, bow to the king.